there must be something initially there, as there must be with all of us, right? That we are born with, with, with gifts and weaknesses and vulnerabilities and talent and some, you know, and blue eyes or brown eyes and short legs or long legs. We're born with a kind of, you know, um, stock of, uh, of attributes. That's true of all of us. Um, I don't think the, the shopping list for leaders is terribly specific. So I don't think that great leaders or effective leaders, noteworthy leaders are born with, you know, with this particular concatenation of attributes. I think what determines whether a leader is effective is how they use not only their talents, their strengths, and their experiences, right, that, they, that happen to them, that they come to along their journey, but also what they make of their failures, their own vulnerabilities, their own weaknesses, and, the, and finally, a host of attributes that I think some leaders purposely, effectively cultivate, as Lincoln did.